As many of you know, I love making awards. And if you own a laser, awards are one of the easiest things to make because people always want them. They want something unique. And this particular project we're going over today is going to be one of those things that I think are going to allow you to make something that stands out from the rest. You can use all different kinds of materials. Uh, you can use different colors. You can paint it. You can make it a single layer base, a double layer base. Lots of variety, lots of options. But let me just jump into showing you the pieces and how this goes together. Okay, let's first start by going over all of the pieces and then I'll show you how they go together. This one's really easy. So starting over here on the right, we've got the two base pieces and then we've got the different uh, pieces I call frames, the uh, right side, the middle and the left side and also these two of these go on the back side as well. Then you've got the layered thank you text and you've got the main piece that you engrave with the award uh, and the name and the details that you want. Let me touch on one uh, detail real quick. If you decide to do this with wood, like this example is, then you will engrave whatever text you want right here just like this. If you're going to do it with clear acrylic, I recommend that you invert the text so that it's backwards because it looks better if it's uh, engraved on the back side and uh, then it's smooth on the front. That's up to you, but that's a look that I prefer. Just don't forget to do that if, if indeed you want to do it that way. And so this is how this goes together, really, really simple. The first thing that you can do if you want to is you can cut all of these pieces except for the base. And then after you've cut these pieces, then what you can do is you can measure the thickness of your material here and then adjust these slots accordingly if you wish. Or you can, uh, you can measure this first, you measure your material first, and then make the slots. But I found that it's kind of easy to just cut this piece first, cut all these pieces first, and then do these pieces last because this is the only part that might need to be adjusted depending on what material you're using. So in this case, I am using MDF from SmokyHillDesigns.com, De Smoky and uh, that's where I've got mine. And let me go ahead and let you know what the thickness of this material is exactly in case you decide to use it yourself. Of course, I didn't have my calipers in hand, but now I do. So let me show you exactly what this measures out to. So this measures out to 0.1215. And so the slots that I have on here, I believe I did, I did the slots at 0.115. So it'd be nice and snug, but make sure that you check that with your materials and test it before you cut everything. Uh, but in this case, the way that I did it makes a really snug fit. It's really nice. So you just simply take this, put it right in that slot there. And again, this is a very snug fit, just like that. And then the next piece goes on just like this. So now I've got that basically done. And then all there is left to do is to simply glue on these frames here just like this and of course obviously I'm not going to glue them on for the example but you'll see how this goes together then you'll take the left side put it here and then these two go on the back side if you wish I think it just gives it a very finished look regardless of which side someone's looking at it from or even if it's from the side so this goes on this one and this one goes on the back side there and then your thank you text would just go just like this, just like you can imagine. Just like that, if you wish to use that. And then you know, again, you engrave whatever you want to there and it looks fantastic. You can mix and match different materials here. Again, in the example, you know that I did this piece back here in some uh, fluorescent green acrylic. I think it looks amazing with a contrast of a dark walnut on the front. Or you can do MDF and paint it all and do different things that way, but you have a lot of options. This is a really great uh, looking style of award. It's really a little different than a lot of them that you see, and I think people would really enjoy this. Let me know if you have any questions, but it goes together really easy, and I'd love to see what you guys make with it. Again, hit me up with questions and send me some pictures, but until then, I'll see you in the next one.